loves, so welcome back to my channel. It's me, KJ on the And for today's video, I'm gonna be talking about how I made this crochet wig using a lace wig cap, y'all. I'm gonna say that again, a lace wig cap. If you're interested, then keep watching. Let's get started. So today I'm gonna be using Free Trash Lace Crochet Wig Cap. It is a five inch lace. As you can see, the cap comes with three combs, two on the side and one at the back. The hair that I will be using today is from divatreads.com using their Dominican blowout straight hair in the color 1 18 inches. The hair already come pre-loop and you can also put heat on the hair up to 400. To achieve this style today I used a total of 6 bags. Here are some of the materials that you will need today for this video. You'll need 2 clamps, a crochet hook, a small crochet hook, and the mannequin head and the cap. As you can see, the hair already comes pre-looped and it has like a little plastic wire around it, so I'm not gonna take that off. And I'm just gonna do the regular crochet method and I'm just gonna tie it once. Because the hair already had the plastic around it, I just slid the plastic up to make sure that the hair is secured. As you can see, there is two different net sizes on the cap. As you can see right now, I'm showing y'all that it kind of looks like a little flower. So I'm taking the little center of the flower and that's what I'm going to begin to crochet it. And that is what I did throughout the entire crochet process. Right here, I'm just showing you that I did not put the crochets close together. I spaced them out because the hair will cover up the gaps. As you can see, that part is too wide and that is not what we want. So I'm going to show you how to get the part smaller. Okay, so now I'm at the top closest to the lace. At the top, I took the hair out of the um, plastic wire and took small sections and started to knot them very small close together. Whenever you start to crochet inside of the lace, which is what I'm about to show you now, you have to have a very small crochet needle because if you don't, you would not be able to get the crochet hook to go inside the lace. 
I searched every local beauty supply store to look for this crochet hook and I couldn't find it nowhere until I thought about Sally's Beauty. So yeah, that's why I got it from Sally's Beauty, y'all. Go get you one. When crocheting inside of the lace, be careful for you do not rip the lace. Initially, I was only going to crochet one side of the lace, but it was still kind of fat, so I ended up doing both sides to make the part smaller. And this is how it looks when I finish crocheting both sides of the lace. To make it natural, I put some powder on it, some makeup powder that's closest to my skin tone. And yeah, that's it for this video, y'all. And this is how it looks when I finish and put it on. Let me know what y'all think. Comment down below. Let me know in the comment box what y'all think. I love it. And also, y'all, I did flat iron the hair just a little on 390.